Now, the U.S. Treasury Department has announced new sanctions targeting a Russian financial firm for helping North Korea to channel funds into its nuclear weapons program. The move is seen as a warning to Beijing as it came right on the eve of Chinese President Xi Jinping's visit to North Korea. Kim Hyo-sun with the details. Washington has imposed fresh sanctions on a Russian financial company for allegedly helping Pyongyang evade sanctions. The U.S. Treasury Department said Wednesday that its sanctions target Russian financial society, which has provided financial services to Tandong Zhongsheng Industry and Trade, a North Korea-controlled entity based in China. It also accused the Russian company of opening multiple bank accounts for a representative of Korea Zinc Industrial Group, which had already been designated under Washington's sanction program. The statement explained that Russian financial society has helped the North channel funds to the regime's nuclear weapons program. The new sanctions freeze all of the Russian financial firm's U.S.-based property. The latest move comes just three months after Washington announced North Korea-related sanctions targeting two Chinese shipping firms. But U.S. President Donald Trump sparked confusion by tweeting a day later that additional sanctions were not necessary. The announcement of the new sanctions, which comes on the eve of Chinese President Xi Jinping's visit to North Korea, is also interpreted as a warning message to Beijing. Kim Hyo-san, Arirang News.